show that I'm not opening. Okay. 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 I'm gonna sit down. So HD lens. Bye. Tickle. What's that saying? So it's two lenses in here. It's a and wide a HD wide and then a super micro. So you can get wide shots and you can do the super close shots. I already have shooting options to help you enhance your mobile photography anytime. Oh my god! I want this. So we open it up. And here is the lenses. <laughs> so let me see. Get this one. It's packaged very nicely. I packed up. Oh, this is the micro lens. Can you see? I mean, micro. Macro. Macro lens. Look at that. That's beautiful. See, digital high definition, super wide angle lens with macro. Japan Ooh, optics. Okay, so they said that both of the lenses are together when you get them. So how do you take them apart? I wonder. Okay, let's figure out that later. So this is the lens. It says the macro. Then let's put that top back on to make sure nothing happens to it. Then. I'm going to have to take this whole thing out because this is in here pretty good. So this is some good packaging to make sure it stay nice and nice and good so it don't break. You should probably put this back in there afterwards, huh? This is the attachment you put on the phone to attach it to the phone. And here are... So here are some instructions here, or just uh, stuff to tell you it, it, the assembly of it. So, yeah, this is this is the wide lens, and then they say the micro is a the macro is a little the little other piece. So these are two separate ones. Let's see. Times 0 0.45 times angle wide angle lens allows more of the scene to be included in a photograph, which is useful. Lens helps to take sharp pictures as close as 50 mm of the subject. And the new design universal clip can attach every. 37 mm thread digital LSR Pro lens on your mobile. Turn your mobile into DSLR camera easily. So, all you do, so they said all you do is attach it to your mobile phone and then that's it. I thought it was going to be like some sort of app or something. So, this doesn't come Oh, this doesn't make sense. I thought it was going to be some kind of app or something, but <gasps> they say you just know put it God. on and that's it. So we are going to get the phone right now and try to see how this is attached, okay? So I'm going to take this snappy piece and connect it to the lens. Like this. Make sure it's on. Here it is. And then I'm going to take the phone. It's a Galaxy 5 Active. And presumably this okay. this goes like like this. On here. Did you see it? Like this. I'm going to put it here. Like so. Line it up. 
acting like I know what I'm doing, but I don't. So we're going to go and evade this phone right here. And we're going to see. Ooh. <laughs> hmm. Let me see. We're going to see something right here now first. We're going to take this off. And see how it looks. Did it take a picture? Mm -mm. Okay. And, ooh, it's kind of blurry. Probably because I'm shaking. Oh, no, there you go. So, there's the picture. Can you see? Okay. I mean, it's clear, you know. This is Samsung Galaxy Home. So, we are going to see. I just want you to get a good look at when I put this on. Well, now, I'm going to put this on. And, I'm going to see what it looks like. It's fish eye. Don't put it on there. Like so. It looks clearer, doesn't it? I don't know. It's fish eye. It's fish eye. Alright, you gotta line it up up there. Okay. See the, um... The flash is blocked. So let's okay. retake the first picture with no flash. Okay. Here we go. So this is with the... Can you see? This is with the attachment here, and this is without it. So it does give a wider shot. You see how mm -hmm. it does give a wider shot? Because I'm, I'm standing, I have the camera positioned the exact same way on both. And as you can see, you can see more at the top, and more at the bottom, and more on the sides. This one is kind of zoomed up in, yeah. It's just as clear. It look pretty cool. It's almost, you can kind of see, it's almost fish eye like. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that's the two. This is with the attachment, and this is without the attachment. I hope y'all can see that. With, without the attachment. And with the attachment. You see, it's, oh, we zoomed up too much. It's a little picture. I came outside and I'll take a picture of this. And that is the picture. That's the log right there. <laughs> and, ooh, ooh, that's blurry. Why? I don't know. Hold on. Let's try that again. I like this angle right here. All right. Looks pretty lit. Let me just wait. Oops. Go back to the picture. Do this with your fingers. Why? Let's see how much it like is wide. Oh, it's like it's like, it's like. Oh, she. It's like that. So it's as wide as the phone. So now we're gonna take the lens and place it back on the camera. We be joyful. She left. Yeah, hey, because I told her she can talk. I guess so. And she don't like me to tell her what to do. And put it back on the camera. Y'all see I just clip it on real cool like that. So, let's take a picture, you know. So now that's the picture of it. This is with the lens. This is without. Oh, you see that? Mm hmm You see how much more it covered? It's a significant difference. See? It's a lot more. Like that. And it's like so that. 
that is a demonstration of the wideness it brings on and we have the camera at the same angle as this picture and it's wider and it's clear look at that look at that now we got to do the macro macro test to see how good of a picture it can take close up okay i like this okay. i like this so hmm I don't know how good I can see it. Wait. Okay, I can see it. Okay, guys. So we are going to do a demonstration for the macro setting where you can get very close to something and still be, you know, it still be um, nice and clear. These pictures, if you can't see it right now, the picture will be at the end of the, what the heck? The picture will be at the end of the video too. So this is it without... There you go, my hand is shaking. Oh my god, my hand is so much. Ooh, wait a second. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that is that. I'll have before and afters at the end of the video too, guys. Just so y'all can see everything better clearly. So we're going to put the lens on now. Back on. And we got to line it up. Okay, it's lined up. Now... I'm gonna get into that. See how close we can get. I'm gonna get right up on it. Let's see what we can do. Please take the picture. There you are, sorry. Ooh. Okay. Still shaking in this picture. <laughs> I'm still shaking in this picture too, but um here is can you see it? Or you got me going this way. Okay. There you go. So here is with the lens. This is without the lens. You see, this is the part that's right. This right here is what I was zooming up on. You see these two parts right here. You see, it's blurry right here. You can't really tell. But on this one, it's clear. So that is the macro demonstration with the lens, without the lens, with the lens, without the lens. The only thing is it covers the, it does cover the, the flash for the camera. So with it being if you would take a picture at the night at night time that wouldn't work too well if you needed the flash you know so I think that might be the only thing but it pretty much works um you know I want to take some more pictures and put them at the end so that is what we will do we'll take some more pictures and then give you a little more commentary and then you can see the rest of the pictures at the end So we wanted to see if it could work on the front camera, right? Why not? So, let's see. Look at that, that's cool. It's like fisheye. That's cool. Mm -hmm. My arms look so weird. What the heck? That's a bar. I mean, god dang it, no. It's Joe. So yeah, this little thing is cool. It's cool. Okay. So that's Good. how they take their pictures. It's cool. Give you a little fish eye effect. They they say you can put this on a digital camera too. They must mean like one of the little square ones because it definitely can't fit on this big Sony thing. What is this? It's a Sony Next Five. Yeah. So they must mean like one of the little small square ones. Y'all see what camera this is, see? It can't fit on there. <laughs> well, maybe it could if you took this black thing off. No, it still couldn't. It's too... Yeah. Okay. So, 
that was our try out of the Universal HD lens from Tekko. Take this box. So yes guys, this is it. Y'all know it comes with the lens cap for the front and the lens cap for the back when you when you take the clip off. So what did you think about the lens? Um I think it's pretty cool. It reminded me of that um Sony phone that they had, this like the Sony and Samsung phone that they had where you can get an attachable lens to put on the back of your phone. That's what it reminded me of when they had came out those phones like a year ago. But I think this is pretty cool. And you got it, it's kind of for cheap. Oh yeah, because I got it for six dollars and twenty one cent. It was discounted on this website that I get my little discounts from. I just started using it, but yeah, it 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 is originally on Amazon because I bought it off of Amazon with my own money okay with my own money bought it off of Amazon just got a discount on Amazon right now it is twenty two dollars and ninety nine cent plus free shipping on orders over forty nine dollars uh, I don't like when they do that free shipping okay <laughs> bought over uh, they gotta be over forty nine dollars see my shipping I got it for six dollars and twenty one cent when it is regularly twenty two dollars and ninety nine cents so that is a big discount it's a big discount so yeah this is this little thing is cool I think it's really cool um I don't know if I'm going to use it that much if I'm like out somewhere mm -hmm. and I want to just like take a whole bunch of pictures and stuff and get right, yeah, yeah, yeah. You want to, yeah. if you went out for a specific photography situation, then this would be good. Um, it kind of, yeah, but um, the only thing is it do kind of weigh the phone down, the top of the phone a little bit. And I guess if you like accidentally like clumsily drop your phone, you would drop this along with it. So I guess you can like just walk. I mean, you could walk around with it, but you got like really. Be, I really could. Safe. You drop stuff all the time. I guess that's what you talking about, clumsy people. Um, yeah, she drops up all the time. She broke two phones. The one that wasn't even hers. Actually, that's, that's not the first one. phone you broke. What is it? No, those, those was the first two, was it? You broke more. No, I, that was the first two I broke. Okay, whatever. Anyway, yeah, she comes in whatever it says. See, she just dropped my thing. This is mine. I bought this. So, yeah, this is really cool. And they left it on the door. They didn't even ring the doorbell. I don't know who mailed this to us, but they didn't ring the doorbell. They just set it up against our Amazon door. Prime. Oh, well, they just set up against our door. They didn't ring the doorbell. Maybe because they said it in the... Maybe it came in the morning. I don't know. They could have rang the doorbell, though. Oh, so it been sitting out there. It been sitting... When I went out... I went out at E12 to go get the garbage cans. They didn't ring the doorbell. And nobody rang the... And I went outside and it was leaning up against our door. I don't know when they came or not, but nobody rang the doorbell all throughout the morning because I was woke, so... Well, I'm glad it didn't rain again today. And I'm glad nobody stole it. So, Amazon um, Prime, y'all need to get it together but as far as this little thing it's cool it does what it says it does we will put all the pictures at the end after after we talk after this mm -hmm. y'all see the pictures um before, before and afters. afters and stuff so i mean with the lens and without the lens so yeah so y'all can see how it is i think it's cool and i think it does what it says it does and i really like it and yeah when you're done with it you know when you just take the attachment off Put your little lens cap on there. I screwed this on really tight. Kicking. Take the um, screw this on. I mean, screw this off of here. I don't know why I took both of them off, but okay. The point is, when you're done with it, take the little clippy off, put it back inside the box because this is a nice box. I love this box. And I like when stuff come in nice boxes. Push it back. Look at this cushion. So that way this won't get messed up. Then they got the lens caps for both sides. And you put it back in there like this. Oh, we go like this, guys. <laughs> and now it's safe and sound. And you can just keep it. I'm going to keep this in this box. So that way it can be safe. Forever! So, guys, thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe, and comment. Do not forget to go check out the website. It's going to be in the description below. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.